here the question is what journal entries would be passed for discharge of following unrecorded liabilities and the dissolution of a firm of partners A and B. A part. There was a on contingent liability in respect of bill discounted but not matured of rupees eighteen thousand five hundred. An acceptor of the bill, one bill of rupees twenty five hundred became insolvent and paid fifty percent the rupee was recovered. The liability of the firm on account of bill discounted and dissolved has not so far been recorded. Now. Out of eighteen thousand five hundred bill discounted, we recovered twelve hundred fifty, but we have to pay full eighteen thousand five hundred. Hence, the net payment in this case will be realization account debited to cash account seventeen thousand two hundred fifty. That is rupees eighteen thousand five hundred minus one two five zero. Being bill discounted, dishonored, paid less twelve hundred fifty rupees. B part. There was a contingent liability in respect of a claim for damages of for rupees seventy five thousand. This liability was settled for fifty thousand and paid by the partner A. Realization account debited to A's capital account fifty thousand each, being contingent liability paid by a partner A. C part firm will have to pay ten thousand as compensation to an injured employee. Firm will have to pay. Rupees ten thousand as compensation to an injured employee, which was a contingent liability not accepted by the firm. Now firm has to pay. That is, realization account debited to cash account, being compensation paid rupees ten thousand to employees ten thousand each. Previously it was not accepted. Now we will have to pay. That means a payment entry will be made. D part. Rupees five thousand for damages claimed by a customer has been disputed by the firm. It was settled at seventy percent by a compromise between the customer and the firm. We have to pay as the firm owner partners that is five thousand multiplied by seventy percent that is rupees three thousand five hundred. D part. Realization account debited to cash account that is rupees thirty five hundred both in the debit and credit column. Being claimed for damages disputed by the company is paid. Debit and credit total will be total will be rupees eighty thousand seven hundred fifty both debit column and credit column, and this is the final answer.